हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू द ऑनलाइन स्पोकन इंग्लिश क्लास इन द प्रीवियस मॉड्यूल वी हैव लर्न अ फ्यू वन वर्ड सब्सटीट्यूशंस व्हिच कैन बी यूज्ड इन प्लेस ऑफ अ नंबर ऑफ वर्ड्स एक्सप्रेशंस फ्रेजेस और इवन क्लॉजेस इन दिस मॉड्यूल वी शैल लर्न सम मोर वन वर्ड सब्सटीट्यूशंस so let's start the class now let's see the first group of words a grass eating animal or we can simply say herbivores herbivores are animals whose primary food source is plant based many herbivores have special digestive systems that let them digest all kinds of plant grass including grass now let us see how to use the word herbivores in a sentence please repeat after me herbivores animals feed only on plants and grass An elephant is a herbivorous animal. Now, let us see the next expression. One who cannot be corrected or we can simply say incorrigible. An incorrigible person or behavior is beyond correction, reform, or alteration now let us see how to use the word incorrigible in a sentence please repeat after me he is an incorrigible thief and has been to the jail many times everybody said that nisha was incorrigible but she has changed so much and stood first in class now let us see the next expression one who is unable to pay one's debts or we can simply say insolvent insolvency is the state of being unable to pay the money owed by a person or company on time those in a state of insolvency are said to be insolvent now let us see how to use the word insolvent in a sentence please repeat after me he declared himself insolvent to save himself from the wrath of his creditors when it was discovered that the loan could not be repaid the bank was declared insolvent Now let us see the next group of words a government by a king or queen or we can simply say monarchy a monarchy is a form of government in which a person the monarch is head of state for life or until abdication now let us see how to use the word monarchy in a sentence please repeat after me england still has monarchy because the head of the nation is a queen
most of the countries in the world were monarchies before the 20th century. Now, let us see the next expression. Practice of favoritism based on kinship. Or, we can simply say nepotism. Nepotism is the act of using your power or influence to get good jobs or unfair advantages for members of your own family. Now, let us see how to use the word nepotism in a sentence. Please repeat after me. Many actors have complained about nepotism in the film industry. The officer was found guilty of nepotism and corruption. Now, let us see the next group of words. One who is all-powerful or we can simply say omnipotent. Someone or something that is omnipotent has complete power over things or people. Now, let us see how to use the word omnipotent in a sentence. Please repeat after me. The doctor said that he was not omnipotent and therefore we must pray to God also. Many kings thought themselves to be omnipotent. Now, let us see the next expression. A person who knows everything or we can simply say omniscient. To be omniscient is to know everything. If you describe someone as omniscient, you mean they know or seem to know everything. This often refers to a special power of God. Now, let us see how to use the word omniscient in a sentence. Please repeat after me. The narrator in the novel is omniscient and he describes all the actions to the readers. God is both omnipotent and omniscient. Now, let us see the next expression. One who looks on the bright side of things or we can simply say optimist. It describes the state of mind of someone who always believes that good things will happen. Now, let us see how to use the word optimist in a sentence. Please repeat after me. Rajiv is a very optimist person as he never accepts defeat till the last moment. As an optimist, I always believe tomorrow will be better than today. That's all for today. In the next module, we shall learn some more one words 
which can be used as substitutes. Thank you.